Hello guys and welcome back to another tutorial on Photoshop CC 2019 where we are going to be looking at some of the basic tools so you can get used to them a bit more. Today's video we're going to be looking at the magic wand tool which you can get selected by pressing the W on your keyboard. If you haven't selected this tool before then you may notice that it's on the, the fourth one down on the taskbar but the default one to be there is the quick selection tool so if your photoshop looks like this hover over it hold down the left click so the menu comes up and then you can select the magic wand tool like so now i've brought in the youtube logo because i feel like working with an image may be um, better for me to explain how to use the tool so you'll just get a better understanding what we do with the magic tool is we can select something and then copy and paste it out of this image so for example if we just wanted this red icon here we'll just left click on it as you can see it, it selects everything of that color and then we can control C to copy and control V to paste and if we hide this layer here as you can see we've, we've picked that up from the image if you want to select more than just one object you can hold down the shift button and that allows you to keep keep clicking and click as many objects as you wish and then we can just use the same formula as before control C to copy control V to paste and as you can see we've copied everything we've selected so hold down the shift button if you want to select or deselect multiple objects if you've got an object selected but you want to select something else you can just click on that object and if you're not holding down the shift button it will automatically deselect the object you've selected previously so I've got the Y selected now but I don't want the Y I want this red icon so I can click on the red icon and it will automatically deselect that one for me if you've highlighted an object but you don't want to select anything so you just want to get rid of the selection box you can hold down control and press the letter D and it will deselect for you we can use this tool to get rid of backgrounds as well. So um, as you can see, the, the background on the YouTube logo file is a, a, a light grey, whereas the, the background on our Photoshop file is white. So what we can do is we can click on the background and it will put the selection around all of the items that are of a different colour. And then you can just press the backspace and that deletes what we've selected so whatever we select we can delete so if we wanted to get rid of the, the red icon we can click on the red icon press the backspace and it will delete it this 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 allows you to get rid of backgrounds on images very easily within a few clicks let's get rid of this background here within a few clicks we we've removed the background from this logo the last thing that I'm going to show you is that if you select an object you can press the alt button and backspace and it will fill whatever you've selected in with the color that you've got down here on the on the front and if you want to select something with your magic tool and fill it in in, in your background color so here we've got the, the gold color you can select that hold down the control button and press backspace and yeah that's the, the basics for the magic wand tool it's used for you can remove backgrounds from images you can select certain bits and images and copy and paste them to other areas or you can select something and fill it in with another color if this was any help to you then make sure to give this video a thumbs up if there's any questions um, or anything that you didn't really understand and you want me to run over again feel free to comment as i always check my comments anyway and if there's any other tools on photoshop that you're not really familiar with Go through my channel i do a lot of tutorials and graphic design related videos and yeah we'll see you in the next one